We started off by uh, putting up a waste management network, collecting plastic waste from barangays, universities, schools. We then brought them into our warehouse where we sort and segregate them. We then uh, put them in a shredder, uh, so they become uh, a mix of flakes, and that's where we transform them into our new products, which are eco lumbers. And that's not even uh, taken into account all the houses that are being destroyed yearly due to floods, um, typhoons, uh, the monsoon rains. And, uh, we have a large network of more than 140 collection points. Some of them are also public drop-off points where people can drop off their plastics. We are now producing roughly 400 planks uh, a month, but we really want to scale up. By the end of this year, we want to collect 500 tons of plastic waste. And by 2023, we want to upscale it to 2,000 tons. So um, basically, we can kill two birds with one stone. So we're not only um, addressing or tackling the issue of plastic waste here in the Philippines, uh, but we're also hopefully contributing um, to the housing sector, where we provide uh, a sustainable alternative product, our eco lumbers. Right now we are um, almost finishing up our first prototype, so we're building a shelter. It's um, roughly 20 square meters and it's built completely with our current uh, planks and posts. This is a transitional shelter that comes in a kit, so it means that it has all the tools and equipment to be built by the locals themselves and it can be shipped to post-disaster communities. So. We've designed uh, this transitional shelter. Uh, this particular unit is roughly 20 square meters total, um, of which 16 square meters is indoor and four square meters is outdoor. So that basically we just have the post, but each of the walls are very flexible. So each user, so each household, whether it's a family of four or whether it's a family that has a Sari Sari store, can actually decide themselves what they would like for their interior or partition. So either they can go in and have like a separate sleeping room or they can say, no, we want to have a separate Sari Sari store with a separate entrance over here. Another thing is, is that this model is the 20 square unit, but this can be replicated and replicated. So we can attach another grid. And if it's a bigger family, they can actually just extend and then continue on making their house even bigger. It might be strange saying it uh, that uh, our mission actually is there to not exist uh, since we are tackling uh, plastic waste, but it's nice to be part of the transition. Um, and since we have a really big backlog because we've been producing plastics for a uh, a few decades now and uh, oceans are quite filled and land fields are quite filled so we do have still quite a, a big thing ahead of us. 